how to downgrade from MIUI version 10.3.7.0 to version 10.3.6.0. If you haven't already subscribed make sure you subscribe to the channel and click on the bell icon to get notified of new videos hey peeps what's up Manchi here back with another video and in this video I'm going to show you how you can downgrade from MIUI 10.3.7.0 to MIUI global stable 10.3.6.0 why am I making this video I'm making this video because with every video I make about the latest global stable release for the POCO F1, I get a lot of comments asking me how they can downgrade or go back to the previous version of MIUI. So that is the purpose of this video. What do you need? You need to have an unlocked bootloader and you need to have TWRP recovery installed. Why do we need TWRP recovery installed? That is because if you try to downgrade from your system updater menu, it will not let you downgrade it will give you an error message something like this that it cannot verify the update and it looks like the ROM version we are trying to go has a security patch which is lower than the current version so this is why we cannot downgrade from 10.3.7.0 to 10.3.6.0 by using the system updater and this is why we need to have an unlocked bootloader and we need to have TWRP recovery installed. I have separate videos for both of those which are linked in the description of this video. And if I go into the gallery, I also have this picture which I have just taken. Now what are the files which we need? All the files which we need are linked in the description of this video. The first file which you need is the full ROM zip file for MIUI 10.3.6.0 global stable. The next file which you need which is disable force encryption. This is optional but I personally recommend that you always flash this. Then you need Magisk version 19.3. Again this is optional as well. And the next file which you need is the TWRP recovery image file for the Xiaomi Pogo F1. This if you want to keep TWRP recovery. The next thing which we need to do is we need to go into settings and then we need to go into lock screen and password and remove your fingerprint, face data and screen lock. Once that is done, go back, scroll down, go into me account and remove your me account. Then go back, go into sync and remove your Google account. We are removing all the security measures and accounts from our POCO F1 so that in case we run into any issues after we downgrade, we do not get locked out of our own device. Once you have removed all these security measures and accounts from your POCO F1, you need to reboot your device once just to make sure that all of them have been removed successfully. Once that is done, we need to boot into to a recovery. For that, the first thing we need to do is turn off our POCO F1 and once we have turned our device off, we need to press and hold volume up and power button at the same time till we see the to a recovery boot logo. Once we are in TWRP recovery, the first thing we're going to do is click on wipe, advanced wipe and select Talvik cache system and data. You can try to update by doing a dirty flash that is skipping this part, but I recommend you do this and this will result in removing all your apps and everything. So make sure you have backed up those things. And once you've made sure all the appropriate options are selected, click on swipe to wipe. Once that is done, click on the home button and back on the home screen, we will click on install and now we need to navigate to the folder where you've downloaded all the files. If you downloaded the files on your phone directly, they will be in the download folder. In my case, I created a separate folder. So we'll go into that folder. The first file which we need to flash is the full ROM zip file. So we will select this file. This is for MIUI 10.3.6.0 and then we will swipe to confirm flash. Once the zip file has flashed successfully, click on the home button, click on install and now we will click on install image. We will select the TWRP recovery image file and on the next screen we will select recovery. As I mentioned earlier, this step is optional. I am doing this because I want to make sure that TWRP recovery sticks on my POCO F1 and it is not overwritten by stock recovery. 
and then we will swipe to confirm flash once that is done click on the home button click on install and the next file which we need to flash is the disable force encryption zip file and again this step is optional as well but i personally recommend that you flash the file once you've selected the file swipe to confirm flash once that is done we will click on the home button back on the home screen click on install and the last zip file which you need to flash is the magisk zip file again optional but I prefer to root my POCO F1, select the file and then swipe to confirm flash. Once Magisk zip file has installed successfully, all we need to do is click on reboot system. Back into Android, let me skip the initial setup. Back into Android, if we go into settings and then go into about phone, you can see that now I am running MIUI 10 global stable version 10.3.6.0 and if we go into the gallery application and then go into albums you can see that here's the picture which i had taken so our pictures videos those things were not lost however we did lose our applications and other things which you can avoid if you try to do a dirty flash i was trying to be safe which is why when we booted into twerp recovery we went into wipe and wiped dalvik cache system and data you can choose to just wipe Dalvik and cache and then that would be a dirty flash in that case your applications will remain intact so that's it peeps this is how you downgrade from MIUI version 10.3.7.0 to version 10.3.6.0 that will do it for this video peeps I hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome See you when I see you.